and welcome back guys, this is Cambo here playing Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines for GameAnyone.com. So in the last episode we just found out where Lily was hiding, well apparently hiding is in the blood bank. So first things first, we need to find out the closest access to the asylum, which is number 6, which is F. I think I was actually near it in the last part. No, I wasn't. I was going the complete wrong way, right? Currently, I'm there, so I need to go right and then right again. Mm, there we go. Okay. So, clamp the ladder. Oh, that was close. Okay. Head to the bull bank. That was very close. I forgot that people can actually walk down alleyways. My bad. I should have put a skate on as soon as I walked out. So, F8 it because you're actually safe at the blood bank. Kind of. You next up for the needle? Hmm? Your donation could save a life, you know. Oh, but isn't it a little late for altruism? I don't think you're here to give blood at all. I don't buy it, Jack. I bet you're here to take blood. Am I right? You offering? Right down to business. None of this pretend I don't drink blood shit. Very refreshing to find a decisive customer. I respect that. So, what'll it be? I need to get to the back room. Employees only. Them's the rules of the queen bitch herself. Queen bitch? Now serving number 75? Number 75. You're lucky I left my shotgun at home. Goodbye. Okay, so let's try and lock, unlock this door. Hey, okay. They're in the back. Right. Don't go in there. If you're an Osferatu, you will break the masquerade. Instead, go in this door. Add the computer, type in freezers, and hack it. Okay, get the passcode, which is 1969. Head to the freezers, get over here. Okay, open the first one. Move the boxes out the way. Okay. Type in 1969, press enter, and then hit the ladder. And here's Lily. Amber, I need it. A drop of it on my tongue, sliding down my throat. The hot flash in my brain lighting up my body. I can smell it everywhere. Blood. What? Um, who are you? My mistake. Let me go. It's painful. Like I'm going to die. It's calling. Never felt like this before. Let me go. I can smell it. I have to have it. Hold still. I'll let you go. Damn, I'm an ugly character. You don't look well at all. Oh, sweet mother of God! Oh, Dell. The heat. Mm, it's never been so satisfying. All of it. I drank until I heard his heart stop and I was sucking on a dry, dead artery. It was euphoric. But I've... I've... killed him. I've never killed anyone before. What happened? What came over me? Calm down. Tell me who you are. What just happened? It's not who I am. I've never done anything like that before. I'm not a monster. Calm down, it's all right. I tried to steal some blood. I heard they sold it. I was hungry, and I can't hunt in town. They caught me, and I was strapped, trapped. Thought I'd never escape, but they killed a man. I have to get out of here. Who are you? My name is Lily. Lily, you're the one E told me about. E? You know E? 
I... How do you know E? If you don't remember who E was, he was the guy on the beach that gave us this quest. He asked me if I knew anything about Thimbloods, which is how I found you. I tried to tell E about his condition, but he was so furious at me for what I'd made him into, he wouldn't listen. A thin blood, from what I've been told, is a vampire whose blood is weaker than most. Go on. Rolf, my sire, told me some vampires consider thin bloods a bad omen and want them destroyed. Rolf wasn't a thin blood, and apparently I am. I don't know why. Rolf abandoned me. His group wouldn't take me in. They said I was a liability. He left me with so many questions, and I did the same thing to E, but I didn't want to leave E. He forced me out of his life. I, I should go. I have to get out of here. Maybe out of the city. Soon. You should go see E. He said he forgives you. He wants to see you. E doesn't hate me anymore? No, quite the opposite. You should talk to him. I'll go see him. Thank you. You're welcome. Goodbye. Oh, about tonight, what I did. Please, don't tell E. It's not my fault. I couldn't control it. I've never done anything like this before. I'm no killer. I promise, Lily, it's not your fault. You couldn't help it. Goodbye. Now we walk away all cool like. Why do you have to go and let that bitch out? There's one less bitch in the world now. Why do you have to let her go and eat him, huh? No, I'll never get to do in that bastard myself. Well, you know what? No blood for you. No more. I don't need your blood, not when I know how you're getting it. Blood comes from out of the living, from all kinds in a red torrent. The crimson seep at the speed of a heartbeat. For each drop, a teeny bit of life shed. You don't care how it's got, as long as it is. You'll be begging for it, and not getting any. Whatever. Because to be fair, I like rats better than human blood. Okay, so, let's go this way. And up this door. As you know, best bet, open this door from this side, because it automatically unlocks it. Okay. Now you can actually talk to him again, and do a side quest to get more, get him to resell your blood, but I don't really think it's worth it. So, let's go. Okay, let's go pay a visit to Mercurio now, because he... Got to, well, we have to give him some morphine, so let's go give him it. Right. Mm, let's go this way. It take me a little bit longer, but I have enough blood. Go talk to Mercurio. Oh damn, did you die on me? I brought you some morphine, hold still. Oh, oh holy Christ, I needed that. Hope that helped, goodbye. Okay, now you see, I have full humanity now, which helps. Missing means that I probably will never fail a frenzy check, so. That's always a good thing. Whoa! That guy got a bit too close. Okay. I'm just gonna head for the alleyway to get down the manhole there. One more skate. And into the manhole. F8. Alright okay, guys, I don't think I said in any of the other videos, F8 is what cancels timer based term talent. So Oh, 
okay, that rat just glitched. But, but, okay, so now we want to head back to the beach and we'll do a main quest. Okay, so to get to the beach, I need to go through access point. Hmm, can't remember. Oh, well, let's go find a map. I think it might be D. Can't be too sure. Um, yep, it was D. Now the way I normally do this main quest is to basically go in there and talk to the guy, normally. Because I'm a... But actually no, I could tell go in and talk to him, but... It is a combat zone. Nah, I'll do it the sneaky way, since I'm a Nosferatu. Okay, so first things first, talk to Lily. Hi. How'd it go with A? This life's been hard on him. Both of us. But he forgives me. We're leaving soon. I have some family with a place out in the middle of nowhere in Oregon. It should be okay for us to stay out there, as long as long as long as we're together. Um, uh, you probably want your stuff back then? Yeah, take it. Goodbye. Okay. And let's go talk to A. You brought my Lily back. She told me all about what happened. I don't know why you helped us, but your blood's worth bottling. I'll never let her go again. Thank you. You're welcome, A. Keep her safe. We're going to be getting out of LA soon. Too dangerous here. Rosa told us something big's about to happen, and I don't want to be here when the Jack comes out of the box. Take that for what you will. Jack comes out of the box? I don't like the sound of that. Goodbye. Okay, so, I now have 10 experience points, I'm going to spend it on Ops, okay. So, level 3, Hidden Killer. You may perform stealth kills while invisible using the attack key. Be careful not to touch your victim, or else you will be revealed. Additionally, any melee attacks that break Ops, okay. 3 will gain a 50% damage bonus, cost 1 blood per, act per activation, that's 22 seconds. Okay. Hopefully, I nearly need to get to 5. It's 26 seconds. So yeah, hidden killer. 4 means I can run, which actually helps. Only 15 experience points, but that comes later. So, let's yeah. look at the skate. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm gonna crouch here. And put up skate on. Okay. Oh look, a fence board! See, if you sneak through this way, this guy will see ya, I think. As I've said, this is the first time I'm doing it the sneaky way. Okay. Nail the power switch. Do you want to give a couple seconds so you can actually see a guy in white walk over here? Oh, and guys, that's all we have for this time. So, I have been Combo, and I will see you next time.